Hey, hi, in this uh, video I want to take you from ground zero Freedom Studio with a brand new workspace and I'm going to show you how to run CoreMark on a core. Uh, so we'll start here with this empty workspace. Uh, first thing we're going to do is import our core as an IP project. I'm going to import the S76 here. We're going to flash it and we're going to create a software project. So click finish here. And our flash wizard automatically starts. I've got my RD board all hooked up, ready to go. As the uh, wizard says here, everything looks connected and ready to go. So we'll go ahead and flash it. Okay, we're done flashing. And here's our typical normal warning program. Press the prog button. I'll reach over there and press that so we can get our core running in there. Click OK. And then here's our new software project wizard. We're going to choose core mark here. Uh, and we're going to create a launch config for it. And click finish. All right, CoreMark is finished building and our debug launch configuration dialog opens. Everything is uh, configured already. Uh, now we do know that this is a release build, so we're not actually going to debug it. Uh, we want a release build with all the optimizations and everything to come with that to get an honest uh, and accurate CoreMark score. So uh, one thing on my system, for whatever reason, these low port numbers just don't work well for me, so I always have to bump them up. Uh, I'm not going to debug this just yet because I want to open up a serial terminal so we can see the output from CoreMark when it runs. So we'll click Terminal, Serial, my COM17 is the only COM port I have. It's the one on the digital part on the RD board. Click Open. Okay, now we can run up here, go back up here, open up our configurations, click our configuration, and we're good to go. Let's go ahead and run this. And there we go. Here's our results from CoreMark. We can terminate the program now. And that's it. That's how you can. Uh, that's how easy it is to import a core and run CoreMark in Freedom Studio. Thanks for watching. See you next time.